I always wanted to send special occasion wishes to all Facebook groups, but I can't go through each one of them and post the same post again and again. So today I am going to automate the process using an app called Spidey. You can find the app link in the description. It uses block-based drag and drop system to program a web automation. I am going to create a function using the function block to log into Facebook so that I can hide the function block and focus on the automation. Drag and drop the go to website block to tell Spidey to go to a specific URL. In this case it's Facebook login page. Call the function with call function block. Always run and test your script after a change. This allows you to catch errors easily. Use the wait and click on block to click on an HTML element. Use the get HTML elements block to get an element or multiple elements from a web page. Click the record button and long press on an element to select. Click the add selected elements to confirm the selected element. Then drop a type event block to type your Facebook email address. Do the same for the password input. Finally click on the login button. I am going to move the function outside of the screen, so that you won't be able to see my password or email address. Let's run and see if it works. It works, now we need click on the not now or the OK button. Use the wait and click on block, this will wait for the element before clicking. Use the sleep block whenever possible. This allows the browser to properly render the content. Now I am using the go to website block to navigate to the groups page. I am using the count with loop to scroll to the bottom 5 times, because more groups will load when you scroll to the bottom. Use the scroll to bottom block to emulate the scroll event. I am going to wait for 3 seconds to let the groups loading. Let's run and see if it works. Great. It's working fine. Now let's get all the group's URL using the get attribute of all block. This block returns an array which we can loop through using the for each block. When we long press and select an element, we can't be sure about which element will be selected. It could be the children element or the parent. I want an anchor element, but I selected a div. I know there is an anchor element close to the div. So I use the switch to the nearest element to select the anchor element. Then I use the select all similar elements to select all groups. I am going to use the go to website block to navigate to each groups. In every group I have to click on the post box to post something. Then I am going to wait for the post box to load. Wait for elements will wait until the given element rendered.
After that, I am going to click on the post box before typing. Now, time to type our post. This month is a plastic-free July, so I am going to post something about it. Finally, wait for a couple of seconds and click on the post button. And give few more seconds for the processing. The script is done, let's run it. Great, it's working. Next time if I want to post something to all groups, I can use this script. What would you like to automate?